May this be the start of a beautiful relationship. Ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages, and some adults, welcome to 007 Nightfire. One of my favorite titles for the PS2 and for the six generations ever. This shooting game has been my life and the new golden eye. So let's get started right now. MI6 has been contacted by Alexander Mayhew, Raphael Drake's chief of Asian operations. Mayhew fears that Drake intends to kill him, holding him responsible for their little setback in Austria. In exchange for our protection, Mayhew will deliver evidence exposing Drake's master plan, codenamed Nightfire, a scheme that Mayhew insists threatens global security. The name's Bond. James Bond. Mayhew's son is expecting you. Mayhew has one demand. To be brought in by James Bond himself. Our informant awaits you at his Japanese estate. Good luck, 007. Ah, Mr. Bond, at last. This is Kiko Hayashi, my bodyguard. I assure you, she's quite skilled. No doubt. The Nightfire data make you. We weren't expecting other guests. Please, stay with Alex. It's Drake. Quick, we must get to the security bunker. Okay, let's get started. <laughs> Back up. Hmm, sit down. Can't touch him. He's number one. Gotta protect my peoples. Alright. Oh, so it's been so long since I played this game. To me, this is one of the most legendary titles I've ever played in a long time. It's the new GoldenEye back then you know four players bots great great weapons life and armor you see this we don't have that anymore we have the call of duty you know recover your life bullshit now remember saving armor and shit used to be difficult back then alright let's go they're waiting for me. Nope. The only bad thing about this game, it was kind of, uh... It's kind of hard to aim. The auto-aim in here is kind of terrible. And the hit detection for shotguns was just... Really bad. So it took a couple of shots. Hmm. And plus, you know, they couldn't put in the the realistic hits for, like, headshots, because all James Bond games, they're T team for teams. So, you know, you gotta hit that, you gotta hit that uh, criteria, man. You can't have the full headshot feeling of a Call of Duty. It's not gonna happen in a T for team game. But for, before it's time, man, this game is still fucking legendary. Back up. And there was no melees. I mean, unless you switch to your hands. <laughs> Look at this. Hmm. Fuck your priceless art. We're close to the bunker now. Alright, time for a break. You're looking for is locked in my bedroom safe. This is the key. Just feed it to the dragon. The dragon? Right. Keep your head down. I'll be back for you. Also, could you wipe the hard drive on my computer? I don't want to leave a data trail for Drake to follow. And please protect my servants. They're like family to me. Alright, and we're back. Let's pick up some armor. 
Let's action for some camera view. Let's see what's going on. Saw some weapons. Is that a... What is that? Oh, okay. Got some stun grenades. Did not know that was going to be there. some slowdown. That's what happened with these old school games. Now currently I'm playing this on the Xbox 360. Uh, some games are backwards compatible. Uh, for this title, actually, s only a chosen few boards are actually playable. I gotta be careful here. Back up, son! Woo! Anyway, some games are backwards compatible. Uh, I also, you also can play, like, SSX and, um, 3, SSX Tricky. If I live through this, I'll need a large socket and one hell of a massage. Go ahead, James Bond, interrupting me while I'm doing my business. Okay. One hell of a massage, huh? Uh, there's a little trick in here. One of these grates open. I just can't remember which one. Oh. Oh, back up, son! Relax yourself. There we go. Let's go down here. Like I was saying before, you can play like older games for Xbox 360, but it depends. Uh, it depends on like uh, how it runs, the frame rate. Some levels you can't even play at all. Some games just won't play. Period. So that's that's another thing about that. Let's go ahead and throw this in slow motion. Yeah, there's some there's some slowdown going on. Well, at least you guys can see gameplay in slow motion. So why you guys seeing this uh, Matrix Reloaded as knockoff? Why don't you put in the uh, put down in the comments what games they used to play back in PlayStation 2 era? If you had a GameCube or Xbox, uh, name that too. You know, uh, back then I used to play uh, Time Splinters, Future Perfect. You know that game was one of the best shooters I've ever played. You know, you, you can have your halos, man, but time splinters or something else. When you can play as a chimp, poof! You can play as so many characters to choose from, you know. Everybody had their own stats. That's, that's what made the game fun. Come on, Free Radical. We need you to come out of your grave and bring back time splinters. EA, do something. You'll win everybody's respect. If you bring bad time splinters. I wonder if I'm not, am I supposed to shoot this? Okay. Cool. Alright, let's get deeper inside the dragon. Oh, somebody wants to die. No. No. Damn. In slow motion, too. Jesus! Got him. Yeah, yeah, we can skip that. We already know you get it in the sheets. Alright. 
I'm not taking that underground passageway. You don't get any James Bond special award or anything like that. Alright, so this is where the game starts to run a little slow. Multiple enemies. Yeah, come here. And back then, games used to let you hold so many weapons, you know? That used to be the fun about these games. You can hold as many weapons as you want. Not everybody want to be realistic. Just, just bring back the good old times, so you can carry 20 guns at one time, you know? That way we don't have to die so fast. You can have a whole arsenal. Oh, you still alive? Hmm. Switch, switch guns real quick. Come here. Man, that took so many bullets. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and do this shit right. Cause uh, last time I fucked that up. My bad, lady. I'm sorry. Will you ever forgive me? Come here. Come here. Man. It's like the creators of the game just watched The Matrix Reloaded and dressed up everybody in the Yakuza as fucking <laughs> as fucking Neo and Trinity. Like I, just, I gotta kill this fucker first. Come here. Yeah, come here. No, you the good you saw. All right. Sheesh, this game is running super slow. Not yet. Let me see if I can find something before I go. All right. What are the objectives? All oh, right, I have to destroy the computer. How can I forget that little tidbit? See, when there's not too many people in one area, then the game runs smoothly. Otherwise, this thing will take its jolly old time. All right, let's see what's next. Gotta rescue this. Adam. Alright, I gotta start using the actual manual aim. Gotta take these guys out before they get smart. I am not trying to fail this mission again. Boom! Give me them cheeks! Girl, you better be grateful. I need some body armor. Lord, help me. Hmm, back up, son. Yes! See, that's the... That's the fun of exploring. You find shit that you need. Back up. Give me these weapons. Come here. Whoopsie. So you're just exploring everywhere. We'll find you new stuff. Let's see if we can get this sniper. Got him. Alright, now we can run across here. Hopefully... Can I jump over? Nope! Let's go ahead and use this stun grenade. Ooh, come on. Hmm. Hmm. 
That's awesome. Not all the objectives are complete. Yeah, they fucking up. Yatsu, you could you saw? Yatsu, Yatsu, Almost messed that up. Can't be playing with these hostages. Back up. Come on, baby, baby. Where you at? Don't act slick. Now I gotta find this dragon everybody's talking about. My man said to feed the dragon. Let's see if we can find that in here somewhere. No, no. So I'm moving around way too quick like. Let's look on our objectives. Retrieve the dragon safe contents. There it is. Jesus. Showtime. That took like, what, five to ten minutes? Just me walking around. I'll, I'll see if I can uh, speed that clip up for you. Because I don't want you guys just looking at me wander, wandering around aimlessly. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Alright, where's this action door at? Let's get the hell out of Dodge. Alright. We're finished here, Mayhew. Let's go. What about Kiko? Have you seen her? She's a big girl. I'm sure she can take care of herself. Uh-oh. Well, now, this ninja dude was some bullshit. Wait here. Let's get moving. Ooh! That damn flipping around ain't gonna help you. Mm, fuck you. Mm. Oh, I've been missing this whole time. Oh. Die. My man doing somersaults. Come here. Oh, is that an armor I see? I know y'all see that. Mm, give me those. Whoopsie. All right, come here. Mm. Mm. All right. Back it up. Back it up. Yeah, motherfucker. Take that. All right, guys. That's the end of the first episode. Oh, sheesh. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys enjoyed this flashback, and I'll continue more with Super Spy no September with more episodes of Nightfire and newer games dealing with spy and secret agents. All right, Cafe Ole, peace out. Enjoy the scene. I was pinned down. I promise you, Drake will pay. Kiko, you're not safe here. Come with me. 